what's up, Bailey here. And for those who don't know me, I'm a virtual assistant, OBM, and mentor for people who wanna start their own virtual assistant business. I left my toxic nine to five three years ago and since then have built a business that I'm proud of, that provides me the freedom that I desire, and that pays the bills to boot. And I'm here to show you how you can do it too. I have a little bit of a story for you today. And while I won't get into the nitty gritty details, my jump into the virtual assistant world was not smooth and was very unexpected. I got let go from what I thought was a secure position and was left at a crossroads for which I chose to start a business, mainly because I wanted to control my own income and live life on my own terms. Little did I know all of the unexpected perks that came with being a virtual assistant some of which I knew going into it, but there were so many little things that I didn't realize that have really made an impact on me, and I can truly say that I love my job. While every day is not sunshine and rainbows, being a virtual assistant is one of the best decisions you can make for yourself. I truly believe that. Being able to work from anywhere is my favorite perk and is one of the real reasons why I started my business in the first place. I'm from a small town in Canada, and if you know anything about us Canadians, you know that it snows here a lot, and that it can be very dangerous to drive in the winter during snowstorms. Being able to work from anywhere, mainly my home, has been a lifesaver quite literally. I've enjoyed this perk so much that I spent a month in February in Texas last year so that I can enjoy the beautiful weather while still running my business. I will likely create an entire video on what it's like to work and travel, but it is one of the best perks of the business that I want you to take advantage of. This one is likely a big one for most of you, and if it isn't, it should be. Being able to take control of your income can be terrifying, but also so empowering, and your life can change drastically due to this. You no longer have to go to your boss and ask for a measly raise. You can tell your clients that you're raising your rates, within reason, of course. You no longer have to work 80 hours per week, if you don't want to, and you can at times make the same amount working a full-time job in the office in less time in your business. If you wanna grow your income even more, you can try offering premium services or grow a team so that you can expand and take on more clients. You also get to choose who you want to work with. No rude, overbearing boss, no clients who treat you with disrespect or tear you down, no annoying or smelly coworkers, all of that goes out the window when you're a business owner. Keep in mind that some clients do have their stressful days and there will be likely times that they're stressed and snappier than usual. But for the most part, you should choose amazing clients that work well with your personality, treat you with the respect you deserve, and that make you happy to show up to work on your computer every day. You can also choose to hit that like button for the YouTube algorithm. If you like this video, then hitting the like button will help me out tremendously. One of the big selling points for moms is the fact that you can have a flexible schedule and can be there for your children and watch them grow up. Well, I don't have kids myself, I look back and wish so much that there would have been something like this whenever I was growing up to have my mom stay at home with me more. She was always working and I realize how fortunate moms are to have these opportunities now. I will also say that I have no idea how hard it is to run a business while raising children, especially little ones, but all moms are superheroes. That much I do know. Having a flexible schedule also benefits people who have to take care of a loved one, someone who wants to travel and see the world, Basically, anyone can benefit from a flexible schedule at any time. You get to set your own hours, work within a time frame that suits your needs. Nobody else controls that. So this last one actually started out as a bit of a joke, but I realized in the early days of starting my business how much I actually didn't put pants on during the day. It was so freeing to not only not wear pants, but not have to get dressed up, put on a full face of makeup, and be presentable for the day. I've even taken a call with a client with no pants on one day, just to see if I had the confidence to do it and to truly enjoy what it's like being a business owner. That freedom is something that can only be explained by the fact that you don't have to wear pants. I will say that I have stopped taking advantage of this perk so much now as I enjoy the stability of my routine and getting dressed. It makes me feel accomplished, but that doesn't mean from time to time you can go to work without pants on. I will admit that not every day is as freeing as not wearing any pants, but it's the perks above that keep me going the amazing clients I'm privileged to work with, the freedom that I have to support my friends and family, the fact that I can travel without requesting any days off, these are the things that make the business worth it for me. And I hope you found things that make worth starting a business worth it for you. Now is the best time to start your virtual assistant business. Well, actually, the best time was yesterday, 
but the second best time is now. If you enjoyed this video, then please hit the subscribe button below, smash that like button, and don't forget about the notification bell, which allows you to be the first to know when I post a new video.